Hey guys, thanks for joining me. Karen with Creative Paper Artisan here. And I just, I've been trying to think of what I can do with these strips of coffee dyed paper that I just can't seem to throw away because <laughs> they're just, they're pretty. They're so pretty. Um, you know, I've made belly bands with them. Um, actually, I think I have... I have some here just to show you. I mean, they make great belly bands, right? I made these quite a while ago, actually. Haven't used them yet. Um, so there's that. Um, but I just, I don't know. I wanted to do something different. So I had an idea and I'm going to play around with it. And I thought I might as well turn the camera on and uh, take you on my journey. <laughs> so if you're watching this video, it turned out okay. My idea turned out fine. Um, and if you're not watching this video, it didn't. And you won't know. <laughs> it's magic like that. So anyway, so what I thought, what if I did kind of like, like a basket weaving concept? And I don't know if this has been done before or not. I didn't, I haven't taken the time to, to even look and see. <laughs> I just wanted to start playing. So I'm going to start playing. Um, and these aren't all obviously not, they're not all the same size, but I'm going to say that I need to have at least some that are the same size, right? <clears throat> Let's see. Let's see how many I can get of the same width and length. Looks like this is the, that's the winner there. Um, that's there. That's there. Oh, okay. This is, this is the clear winner. So I think that's what we're going to work with. Although I'm, I'll make my little pile here. That's not the same width. Oh, look, my pile is dwindling. That's fabulous. Okay. So put that away and maybe tuck these away for a minute. And <clears throat> let me just kind of pick the most interesting sides. I like the dark, the darker stains. I think that's so cool. Let's see. And these are all different batches of paper. You can kind of tell this all came from the same batch and then these, these came from a different batch which is cool because I will, you know, add to the interest. Okay, so let me see here. One, two, three, four, five. Let's just start with the five. So what I'm going to do is kind of weave it, so to speak, like so. And... I have a feeling I need to tape these down because <clears throat> they are going to be moving on me. So let me grab my tape. There we go. I'm just going to do one, one big old swap right there. Swath of tape. That one up a little bit. Okay, so now, now the papers will stay in their assigned seats, right? I think. Let me ask, I just kind of want to straighten them up as much as possible. Okay. All right, now, now they'll stay put. Okay, so I'm just going to... Start weaving. What do you think about that? Okay, so that's about as much as I'll be able to get with these strips and stripes. So now you may ask, now what, Karen? Well, that's a good question. 
<laughs> I think that looks really cool. First of all, hmm, could maybe take that to the copier and copy that, which I might do. But I feel like this would make like a neat, um, like an addition to a page of a journal or even on the cover. So I feel like I need to like attach the, the ends so that they, um, that they'll stick, you know, it won't come apart. So what I'm thinking now, hmm, is what if I trim the, all the edges so that they're even. <clears throat> and wait, something's not right here. That one's not right. Okay. Anyway, I'll trim the ends so that they're even and maybe just put washi tape on the edges and have the washi tape um, be what holds them together. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try that. I'll try it right now. But the first thing I need to do is I need to cut. Um, so let me get my handy dandy cutting mat so I don't ruin my desk. Oops. Be gentle. Be gentle. Okay. All right. And then I line everything up. And then I will cut so that the edges are even. <clears throat> so I want I want it to be a nice tight weave. <laughs> so let me play around with this a little bit more. Okay. Okay. And you know, I guess it doesn't have to be all the same width. I guess maybe, you know, the ones going across this way could be narrower or wider or what, whatever. I think that would be, that'd be okay too, actually. Okay. So everything's lined up. Let me do the ruler along the edge. And then cut it with my exacto. Uh oh. I wanted to shift on me a little bit. No shifting. No shifting. Kind of need to. It probably would be smart to tape the other end too. So it's too late for that now, isn't it? And see now, look, I don't want to throw these away. Gosh, you guys, do I have a problem? I think I have a problem. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, you know what I can do? I have this little paper punch that I've been I've been punching these little leaves out. That's wow, that's small. That's hard to get <laughs> it's hard to get in there without. Okay, maybe that wasn't a good idea. Okay, it was too small for that. I will, I will, hmm, I don't know. I have a problem. I'm going to admit it right here on YouTube. I have a problem. I can't throw these little tiny pieces of paper away. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, that's okay. I'll, I'll figure out something. Or I will throw them away. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so now... I'm going to get washi tape. Okay. I'm looking for something that will complement the paper or something completely contrasting like these flowers. Actually, that's pretty cool. The dark, the dark flowers. Hmm. Let me look in my stash here. The purple, 
springy. No, I kind of want to stick with darker, either dark or neutral, you know? Um, <clears throat> oh, these are cool. I think these are Tim Holtz. They're like uh, cigar bands. I'm not sure they're wide enough, though. I think I think I need... I think I'd like something a little bit wider. So... Oh, yeah, these are cool, too. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm not sure I have enough. I Actually, I really like these. I think these are Tim Holtz, too. I don't have very much left. I'm afraid I'm not going to have enough to do the whole thing. So I will go with a... <clears throat> with a newer roll. So, let's see. I'm, I'm kind of liking the flowers. The dark flowers. Or something really, just really neutral. Hmm, I do like that. Just a bunch of, you know, like a little um, collage of receipts and hmm that's cool it kind of keeps it neutral and I could and I can use it for whatever okay I'll I'll do that I talked myself into it <laughs> okay 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 so now let me oh I hope I have enough of this too there's not very much of that I got this from uh Timu I have a huge selection of just gorgeous washi tapes, but now I see you don't get a whole lot. <laughs> That's why it's so cheap. But it's okay, it's gorgeous. I mean, I usually don't use that much washi tape in one setting, so. All right, so let me get it lined up, bring it over here, and just tape it down. And because it's washy, I'm just going to stick it to my mat so that it doesn't move anymore. Um, ooh, okay. Now, let me let me do this side. And this, this side is taped down, so um, <clears throat> I'm going to have to stand up to do this. And you know what? I think the camera... Is, sorry about that. Okay. I'm not, I'm not crazy about this stand. It doesn't give me as much in and out control as my other stand. But I like how I can position it better over, over the thing. The other one was coming from the side. <laughs> anyway, I guess you can't have it all. So until I figure it out, I'm using, I'm using this stand. But I have to kind of play with it and find that sweet spot. All right. Okie dokie. All right, and of course these are going somewhere else. <laughs> it's an illness. I have an illness. Okay, so then... Kind of do the same thing here. And it's going to be coming to that. So I'll be doing this. Hope I'm getting it straight. Okay. Unpeel that to turn it because I'm, I'm right-handed and I can't I can't do it in any other <laughs> any other direction so then we'll do this one Okay. <clears throat> now, 
I'm just thinking this is a square. This is not going to go in a journal <laughs> page. I don't, unless I make a square journal, but you know what, if I, if I fold it in half, it can be like a uh, part of a signature. I think I'm just going to leave it like this, but now that I think, think about it, if I'm going to do this specifically for a journal page, I need to make it, you know, narrower. <laughs> so it's the size of a page. Ay, ay, ay. Well, that's why, that's why you're experimenting with me, right? Okay, okay. We will learn together. Okay. And then one more. And this is right on the edge of, of the mat. I may have a little little difficulty with this one. I don't know. I, I think I still I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay, here we go. All right. And then one more. I had enough, thankfully. <clears throat> oh, I love this washi tape. So pretty. It's just like tiny little collage. <laughs> okay, so now, now comes the part. How can I <laughs> take this apart without it coming apart? I need to get it off of here. There we go. There we go. All right, and I just want to get just enough. So I can fold it over and make sure that everything stays put. Well, you know what? Hang on. I think it's going to be easier if I just take it all off and then carefully, carefully, wait for it, flip it. <clears throat> and then then I can kind of work with it a little bit better, I think. Get everything tucked in because the, the little ends want to, they want to lift up a little bit. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. And corners need to be a little bit mitered. There we go. Let me go ahead and do that with this one too. Just a little bit. All right. <coughs> Man. I have a gravelly, gravelly throat. Oops, oops. That one's wanting to buckle. Do not buckle on me. Okay. No, I did not. I did not get that one very as straight as I would like. But you know what? I'm just going to go with it. Just going to go with it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think I'm... I'm liking the way this is turning out. I am, I am. I'm 
trying to trying to hurry because I think my phone battery is about to die. <laughs> Oops. I'm telling you, this was like a last minute thought. Like, ooh, I'm going to try this. And then I'm like, ooh, I'm going to film it just in case it turns out well. <laughs> okay. Oh, I like it. Yes. And I'm thinking since I didn't make it the size of a journal page, I can just fold it in half. And then have that just be... <clears throat> Um, you know, in a, in a signature, just part of the signature, and it'll be a smaller piece. And then, oh, look, look at this. It's, huh, let me find something here. Um, well, here's just a piece of scrap, but look, it's like, oh, it's like a built in tuck spots. Oh my goodness. Stop it. Shut the front door. It's like a built in, um, tuck spot page. Everywhere, everywhere there's a slot. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yep. I'm in love. I like this. I like it. I have to think of what I need to, what to call it. <laughs> Basket weave page embellisher or something like that. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what the name, what name comes to me. But hey, cool beans and you can do the same thing on the inside. Tuck, just tuck little little things all over the place. Mm -hmm. Okay. There you go. Thanks for experimenting with me. It's always an adventure. <laughs> all right. You guys have a good rest of your day. Mm -hmm.